So this is the start of the Fushimi and I shrine. This is the start right there. This is the very start. That's pretty convenient for us. Yeah. That'll be the very start. Yep. No, not yet. I swear the taxis here. I swear taxis here just look so cool. Like all the all the taxis in in Perth are just kind of boring. Boring. Yeah. Well, this one actually has some character. I'm not saying that just because like ooh, Japan, but like genuinely like they're they're using like old Japanese Toyota models and then making it to taxis, which is so cool. But look at this. Dang. So we're here. Um, we were about to head there because that's what we just saw. So we need to go up, right, and then that's what we need to go through. So this is the main Fushiri Inari shrine, like the one at the front. It's got all the foxes. It's adorable, they went there on their dad's birthday. They went here on their dad's oh, birthday. That's a dog. Oh, Desmond. Yo, Desmond. I love Desmond. Desmond and Oh, they Zihui. do like love ones. Oh, that's oh, adorable. And then that's their name in probably in kanji. They didn't no. write the name. I feel so lonely. But I need a girlfriend, bro. <laughs> you got me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and so the journey begins between Kirk and his three best like friends. Have popped out yet? No. <laughs> bro, okay. <laughs> Look, it's just the start. I'm not puffed out just yet. Maybe in the first thousand steps. <laughs> and then I'll be like, oof, interesting. <laughs> no, you, I think you mean... <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll just be like... Not gonna lie, I thought that was a real horse for a second. Nay, I'll be your horse. You can ride me. Let's go, Chris. <laughs> And so the journey of the 12,000 steps arises and starts or commences. It's now. Not many. Found we a wild Christian. didn't know where you went. I went in. I <laughs> we said we were going in and then you guys just didn't come. Yeah, because we were waiting for you. We were too busy. I was right next to you. <laughs> I was in front of you when you were recording, you're like, oh, here we go, we're doing 12,000 steps, and then you just stopped and didn't come in. <laughs> now, so now. that's on you guys, okay. not my fault. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're going. Now we're going. So He's a liar. He tells you where they're going when we're not. <laughs> but we're right here. <laughs> step, which is that one. We complete the first step. You go around and you find this market space over here. And then there's like, you know, some stuff that you can buy for tourist attractions and stuff. And then, you got round two. We ended round two. Round three has started now. But look, Walk. way less people, and it's a lot darker. Less Americans, guys. Oh my god, this is the best thing that's ever happened. Koi. I don't think that's I don't think that's koi, but that's some fish Thirsty. for sure. What? You're like hungry. You're hungry. You going fishing? Oh yeah. Oh my god. For some deluxious koi. About 40 minutes left of the walk, and the crowds are looking. 
<laughs> well, 40 minutes of like non-stop walking. Well, there are a few houses over here. I think some people are living here. Especially when you go up these stairs. The view of Kyoto. It's amazing, bro. It's so cold as here. So cold as well. I mean obviously we're going We're going up Mount Inai. So the higher up we go definitely the colder it'll be. Because you know, it is a mountain. Kieran went this way. He went up there. Uh well there's two paths. You can go here or you can go there. But but he he's going here. He's going straight. Yeah, he's going straight right here. This spot. That'll be this way. Um, that's where we just came from. Yeah, so that would be this way. Let's retrace our steps. So that's right over there, so that we, yeah, we have to go straight. It gets a little bit more confusing as you go, because now it's just a loop from here. Which is kind of good, means that you're minimizing the amount of repeats that you have to do. Also, there's a bit of construction over here. I guess they're trying to make sure. Christian! Look how empty it is! Bro, pictures for sure, me and you. here because I got um I got the spoons. I don't even know if they call them spoons but like <laughs> I don't even know if spoons is the right word but like scoop or some sort. Uh, a ladle. A ladle. I don't know man. To cross a prayer area. Um it's not that it doesn't it doesn't trail off from the main path. But look at it. This is the prayer area. <laughs> Just live here in, in the wilderness with the shrines. Just get my, I'll just get my swag and camp here. It's a little, little thing on okay. I don't, I don't know what you call that. Um, it's like an apron of some sort. I don't know. He's a chef. Yo! Chef box. I don't know. Was it? I don't know how long they've been wearing this for. They don't look new, but they don't look old. They're pretty sun faded, so I'd say a while. But yeah. I'd say they replace them every now and then. Yeah, that makes sense. Absolutely being in love with that spot. Now we're gonna keep walking up because we're getting close to the top. There's more spots to see over here. Hi, right, Christian over here just looking like an absolute god. So this this Chris never gets old. You know, we're walking down, but I think we're gonna go up at some point because Kieran and Darcy they're already at the top. But Christian, right, we took our time, a little bit more time. We just went to see what was up. And a little bit of an eating spot here as well. Some people here are just getting snacks. Some tea, eggs. Who's sake for 450? No, that's ridiculous. That's so cheap. What was that map? It's a cloth map. So that's the map of the of the place. Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> Will you consider getting that? 
well. I can just iron it if it gets creased. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You guys are worried about hot foils. However, however, this you can just fire back. That's all you need. Yeah, I mean that's pretty good. I'm surprised that sake is only 450. I am too. Oh, what's it? Oh. <laughs> Just found this spot. I don't think many torch star over here. Oh, okay. This is a hidden spot. Oh my gosh. Hey man, I think your bucket's a little full. I need a bigger bucket, bro. I think so, yeah. So the top, make sure you find that sign that says the top, mountain top. So it's this way, go up here. And honestly, there's just a bit more walking, but way less tourists here. It just keeps getting lower and lower every time. As you can tell, I'm getting a little bit more puffed. Oh, we're close to the top anyways. So I wonder how high we are based on altitude. Definitely hundreds of meters for sure. At least like five. Five. Meters? That's a meter big, I think. Yeah. About there. At least five of those, I'd say. I think that's pretty correct. Yeah. 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 I don't know if this is the top, but <sighs> the gates end here, and then there's a bunch of other stuff up here. Top. We're at the top now. Oh? Yeah. Oh. That didn't feel like as much as I thought. No, it didn't. It felt like a lot higher. And it's only 200, it to the top. 233 meters high. I thought it would be more though. I thought it'd be more as well. I can't believe this is the top and you get rewarded by seeing all of this. Not all tourists go to the top, but I'm doing that right now with my, the microphones. But honestly, it's just such an experience to witness all this. Look at this. Man, I'm so puffed. <laughs> so cool. It's too cool. You reach the top where I just went, where we just went over here, you go straight back down. What time did we arrive here? We arrived here around 10. Yeah, what time is it? It's like, it's 12.20. It's a long walk, man. I mean, we did stop. Quite a, a few lot. times, yeah. I mean, I think it was like two to three hours if it's non-stop. But why would you not stop when you can just be taking some time to look at the hidden treasures here? I'm still glad we're in Japan.